An early afternoon fire on Christmas Eve destroyed a longtime Mason Town business. Crews from at least eight fire departments battled to bring the flames at Klondike Lane's bowling alley in Mason Town under control. Heavy involved commercial structure fire, Klondike Bowling Alley was involved in a heavy fire, flames shooting through the roof, and we pulled on scene. Uh, we used uh, hand lines there and uh, called in Carmichael 65 for their area. The fire also damaged the recently added miniature golf course. Owner Joe Pascia was told over the phone by his mother, who lives nearby, that the family-owned business of nearly 50 years was burning. It, it's just, it, I just can't believe what happened today. It, it's, it's, it's a great loss to, to my family. and I, I've been here since I was six years old. From it was ashes on the floor to concrete to sidewalls, and I kept it in the family. And <laughs> it's something I can't describe. I'm empty inside. I, I've lost all these firemen. They everyone bowled here. It was it was the center of the community, and, and then I kept it that way. And I'm just lost for words. No injuries were reported, and an official from Fayette County 911 said that companies from Masontown, Edenbourne, McClellantown, Ronco, Ada, Footdale, as well as Carmichael's and Nemecolin in Greene County responded. A state police fire marshal has since been called in to investigate the cause. For TheHeraldStandard.com, I'm Robert Esquivel.